one, two, three. Okay. So that looks so good. So work with uh, Control Q. Uh, for some reason that wasn't working. I had to manually start the macro. So use another and. Okay. Okay, so save that, that looks good. So you can check this, is this work with the other? Hmm? This, changing the, the name. Yeah, so now I'm gonna do the next sample, which was CV1 Ocean. Mm-hmm. Mm, yeah, CV1. And then this stays the same for CVs. Um, so you, you understand which sample this should be, right? Mm, yeah, it's the same in the office. It also cop uh, copy uh, the most recent this. CV. Yeah. Okay. okay. But it, it's it compared with the CV, the last CV. In, in office. Mm -hmm. Okay. So let's try it again. Control Q is not working. It says Control Q. I think it's Control A. Or Control Z actually. But I don't know why it doesn't say it here. It doesn't say nothing in the in the square in this the the letter. Yeah. It's empty. <laughs> That's really strange. Okay, so I think it's control Z for some reason. Nope. No. Don't work. Oh no, what I just do. Okay. So that's an issue. Uh, I will change that macro. Um, and it doesn't doesn't send you any any message when when it's an error. It's it tells you yeah. that it's, it's something in the in the address. I'll change it. File folder, something. But it in here. So I change it here. I'm gonna change it in the master real quick. Because it should be control Q. Um, this one. Okay. You save it. I saved it, so it should work now. Also, this. Save this. Oh, and oh no. Okay. Yeah, I mean, this is good. I actually. Okay. Yeah. I mean, you're supposed to start from the macro every time. Yeah. That's fine. That's fine. Control Q. Control Q. Okay. It's working now. Okay. So what happened? It just needed to put the Q in. Yeah, it just the shortcut. At shortcuts got lost somehow. And it was empty. Yeah. So I forget what it's supposed to say. So I'm just using the old previous batch of CVs so that I remember what's supposed to go in the lab. This is supposed to be CV. This is the, the date, date of injection. Of injection. Uh oh. It, it needs the, the year. Happened? Year. Oh, uh, because number lot, I think, wasn't there. Was it 10, 31, 23? Okay, what else? 
this should say one thousand. This should say one hundred zero ten. Okay. And, good. Uh, yeah. All the recoveries are good. And this, it's. Oh huh? uh, yeah, it's okay. Oh, it's Okay. And then, do you have internal standards? What? Like, in your analyses? Yeah, the internal standard, the mm -hmm. 10 microliters that I add at the end, or, or what? No, like in previous... Uh, uh, use one. Yeah, okay. Well, these ones have to be within 50 and 200%. Okay. So, it tells you right here um, what it is. If it is outside of that range, then that's a uh, problem. I don't, I don't put any use blank and all the same. Mm -hmm. No, when you vial it, you added these internal standards, and then the instrument read them, and you got like ninety six percent recovery, ninety four percent recovery, ninety three percent recovery. But I'm just saying, like. Sometimes there's an issue and it reads like 205% oh. and so you need to scroll down and make sure that that's not that's, that's normal that it's within range. So okay. this looks good. This looks okay. good. Okay. All right, let's save and do the next one. The next one was the blank. Yeah, blank. It's a blank. Okay. Source I think that should be blank. B L, I think. Uh, Source should say B one. B one. Okay. Oh, uh, in Texas, B1. B1 sample date was the date that we made this sample. Yeah. 10th, 23rd. Okay, what goes here? This is 1000, this is 10, this is 20, 10,000, 0, 10,000. It's in, this is. False. What? <laughs> That's not right. No. Let's see what else. Um. It's a blank. So, but it's the same for the blank. Oh, that's because we usually delete the peak. But for this, we only need one one analyte, or not? Yeah. So usually we go over here. You uh, you put N D N D N D. No. Uh, no. Let's let's go to that computer. We go to the blank, um, and we see like and that's not a real hit. Yeah, we should delete it. Okay. So just, let's see. Let's see process. Will it pick all pick? Yeah. Uh, because that wasn't a hit. So that looks good. Let's check the next analyte. This is a surrogate. It looks good. Even though it's so low, it's fine. This kind of looks like a hit. So I could leave it, um, but the qualifying ions don't look good. Like this doesn't look like a peak. This doesn't look like a peak. Mm -hmm. So I don't think it's a hit. I could try to see if it's really a hit. Let's see. I don't even know how this could be a hit. Maybe that? Yeah, that's still, that's not confirming. This so it's, this doesn't look like a hit. So I'm just going to delete. Okay, and then let's do TBT. 
Also no confirm. Also, it's currently not confirming. Let's see, how's this integrated? That looks decently integrated. That looks decently integrated, but not it's confirm. not confirming, definitely. Like, this is way off the observed ratio is very off from the expected ratio. So that's not a real real pick, real analyte. Yeah. So let's delete this. Delete all. Save. And then next one. No, let's see no one. Oh that's it? Yeah. So you need to resave this yeah. port again. Use one. In the use All right. Method plan B1 10 30, 23 a thousand and the same 10 20 10, 000, zero. Okay. It's still saying it's false. <laughs> Wait, did I pull over the right? Tribute to you. Oh, it's because um You use the same one? Or yeah, I I moved it over to the flash drive, but not to this folder. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I use the same old data. This is the right one. It needs to go in to this order. folder. Nice. Yeah. Because it's reading the data from this folder, not from the flash drive. It's a lot of folders. Yeah. <laughs> It, it might be easier if you just do it on that computer, because that's how the macro is set up. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... This should do it. Yep. There's no MD. values there. Okay, good. Then, method 1, B1, 10, 3, 3, 3, 1000. That's it. That's good. Yeah, that's good. And In. then we have to make sure these are good. Good. Save. Save. And this is just and then, for one. <laughs> yep. And then we just do all of these. Final CV. Then done. I'll do one of them.
Oh, hold on. Roger. That's wrong. Um, because I was comparing it to the 25 PPP standard. I need to um, compare it what to... What happened? This is wrong. Oh, it needs to be the last of each? The last and the last and the last and the last? No, um, the samples get compared to the most recent CV. And the CV? The CVs with this. get compared to, to the, the 25 PPP 25. standard. So oh. this should be know that. this one. Yeah. Oh. Uh, we'll go back over here. Just so it's easier to visualize. Okay. So. The macro uses this standard as the comparison. Mm -hmm. So the ICV gets compared to this yeah. because 25 PPP, 25 PPP. Uh -huh. And all the CVs get compared to this. So this CV. And the last, the all of these, no matter what CV it is, compared it gets compared to the curve. 25. The 25 ppb sample. and the samples the samples compared with the with the most recent cv so this cv was one. run all these samples get compared to this cv if there were samples right here mm -hmm. this one would be compared to this one okay i got it okay Let's make sure this is good again. Okay, this looks good. Is is MRL? No, this is the blank. Also the blank. I I had to redo the blank with ah, this. Ah, for here. the comparison. Yeah. Oh, okay. Maybe a lab. Uh, yeah, lab. Yeah. Test side. Let's do C1. Um, C1. Um, sample date. 10.06. Nope. 10.30? 10 You need to check the the, the Sonia. Yeah. <laughs> because yeah. I I am sure. In um. When was remember it? 20, it's, it's 2022. Yeah. TVT uh, July validation package M MNR study. That's entry. Oh, it's the same. Yeah. Okay, it's MRL1, C1, C1, and then MDL check. Happened then. And this? Sorry? Point three? Old. We probably want to keep this point one seven. 
Okay, so what she did was she deleted these two lines. Uh, I left them just because. So it's okay then? Yeah, because we don't care about these ones. Okay. It's up here, but it's, it's, we don't care. Mm -hmm. Oh, actually, some of them weren't confirming, so you would delete those anyways. So, uh, but this one's kind of hot. Compare it with this, yeah. It's 164. But it's, it's a result. I don't know if that, like, passes or not. Oh, uh, it might not because this is upper control Pink. and it's 150. But it, it, that's uh, macro updated? I don't know. <laughs> okay. But anyways, you could delete these since they don't matter. Um, but you would have to delete them back on the software like we did last, like we did with the blanks. Oh, okay. Since the beginning, the picks, the little picks. Mm -hmm. No, not manually here. Uh, yeah. So, I mean, it looks fine. And then, yeah, you would just do that for the rest of the six samples. 